Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to guide you how we can easily add your own custom font to your Figma file. So before we're going to start, I'm also writing newsletter every single week about designs, how you can make your designs better, new apps that you can use completely for free and you can find a link down below in the description and how we're going to do it. So the first thing that you're going to need is to download a Figma app on your PC and how the whole process works is that we're going to Download a font. So let's say this is going to be font share. Okay. And now let's say we're going to have this Satoshi. And we're going to download it. Download family. Okay. So now we downloaded um, our Satoshi completed. Now we'll just ex extract it. And what we're going to do is that we're going to find it. And then we're just going to add it to our application. What will happen is that these are the like the fonts here. What will happen is that in the moment when you're going to add your font to your app right here, that you're going to install it, then you will automatically find it also in your browser application. So now when you're going to have it, uh, you want to also download when you're going to write the Figma downloads and you want to have like font installers and you want to uh, like install it for Windows or Mac OS. What do you have? I don't know. Uh, so that's something you can do. And when you're going to have it, just download the custom font. Now I'll go to folder, Satoshi Black, install. Okay, now we go to Figma. And now we'll just like close it and open it again. Look at this Satoshi new, you see right here. So this is the new font that we have. And look at this, when I go here to Figma and I'm going to refresh the site and I'm going to write here uh, like the searching for the Satoshi, I have the Satoshi here. So do you see it? So the first thing that you want to do is download the desktop app. Then you want to download also the font installers. Then you want to download a family uh, from or like have the custom font that you want to have, install it and automatically you will find it in Figma, uh, your app on a PC or notebook. And then you're going to have also it right here as a custom font in your Figma app on a browser. So thank you very much. If this video is helpful, you can join the newsletter if you're interested, uh, like weekly tips and strategies, how you can make your UX and UI better. Have a great day and goodbye.